You want to get a beer? It's like 10.30 in the morning. So, shall we get started? I have so many ideas. I got you uh, some waffles here, courtesy of JJ's Diner, and chicken soup, courtesy of me. I mean, don't get me wrong, these people are weirdos, but they're weirdos who care. Hey, are you hungry? I haven't eaten. You know, yeah, there's a really great Cal's own place over in Idiotville. Oh, really? Down on Terrible Idea Avenue. Okay. Corn maids at Harvest Festival. Are dogs allowed? Hey, look who's socializing. Yeah, and I'm having a good time. Sit with us. Okay. Oh, take that curse. Take that curse. I've just honestly never met someone who works as hard as you do. Stay here. Help us build something. I already accepted the job. Um, do you know that wildflower mural up on the second floor? Mm hmm. Yeah? You want to meet there? Yeah. Okay. Sounds good. I'm so annoyed by all these rules lately. I'm back here. Me too. <laughs> well, isn't that just playing right into what they think of you? When did she say... Likes oh, me? Oh, God, this is so high school. Just rent a limo, ask her to the prom. I'm sure she'll say yes. All right. Leslie and I are dating. It's worth the risk, if I can be with you. All right. Well, then I'm in. What are you doing? Are you I'm kidding? sorry. No, it's force habit. <gasps> it was simple, but I liked it. No, of course. Yeah, no, I'll just put on my Star Wars pajamas and sit in my mom's basement. So delicious and rich and golden brown that anyone who tasted them would decide never to leave that town. Thank you. I really needed this. Yeah, we loved it. And I kind of feel like we shouldn't hang out together, just the two of us. Because every time we do, it just makes it harder, you know? Look, I thought I could handle being friends with you, but I can't. This is how I feel. How do you feel? Yes, it was. I think you should go in alone. You're the only one that can save us. Please be my campaign manager. I love Pawnee, and I want to make it even better. Better schools, safer streets. Oh my god! What the hell? I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. That was awesome. I'm so sorry. <laughs> This is the weirdest Valentine's Day ever. She doesn't feel the same way because she has a boyfriend, um, me, and, 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 and we love each other. That's a spirit. But as a woman, all I care about is your slight but powerful body. I got pretty damn lucky when I met Ben. Is this politics? <laughs> what, is, what is that? What, why did you do that? I can do it. I can crush him. I promise. <sighs> ah, screw it. Go get him. Honestly, would you like to do the honors? No, I think you should deliver the news. Yeah, but you're the candidate. Yeah, but you're the brilliant campaign manager. But you're the cutest. I love you. I love you, too. Hey! I never wrote it. Come to my office as soon as you're done, okay? Okay. And it was nice to see you again. Are you talking to my butt? <laughs> yes. Hey, Ben, just a few things to remind you of home, love, Leslie. A spontaneous road trip to surprise Leslie. Yeah, you know what? All right, I'm in. Well, you go get him. I love you. I love you, too. Hey. Hey. I didn't know you were coming back here. Oh. What are you doing? Oh my God, what are you doing? Okay, I still don't think it's gonna work, but I am really attracted to you right now. I know. Let's do this. How did you do this? Call in a few favors. I'm in love with a woman from here. A strange, passionate goofball of a woman. <laughs> me, he's in love with me. 
excuse me, one man's worst nightmare is every other man's total package. Congratulations, you have won the award for best man. You know what, I'm gonna get that commission going because this inequality has gone on long enough. Jay's Diner and Catering, what you've referred to as the wedding of the millennium. Are you kidding me? I thought that I could not love you any more than I already did, but I was dead wrong. Well, let's just do it then. Let's get married here tonight. I love you and I like you. I love you and I like you. From the movie Star Wars, episode one, The Phantom Menace, which, side note, was a terrible movie and almost destroyed the franchise, according to my husband, but that is neither here nor there. You know, when I was in high school, we had to spend a week carrying around a sack of flour, pretending it was a kid. You should have it. You're the best wife in the world. <laughs> I had it made your first week here. I knew you'd be going places, so I wanted to be prepared. I can't believe I'm complaining about how thoughtful my wife is. Sorry, honey. I love you. Look, maybe we should take a real day off and talk about starting our family. Yeah, I, I mean, that sounds perfect. I you a wonderful human being, and I'm proud to call you my friend and don't ever change. Ben, can you help me out here? Maybe we should travel more, expand our horizons. You know, I've had the same kinds of thoughts. I'm always going to be on your team. You never have to worry about that. But now, Anne and Leslie are our real partners. Yeah, it's a good thing. You and Leslie are choice number two. I'm honored. We're going home. Then why would you need to put on roller skates? Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. We're just... <laughs> we're... Just... Skates. But at least we have each other. I love you so much. I love you too. I love him, and I will do anything to help him get his job back. Seriously? Is this for real, Skates? This... I also really need you to respect me. I respect you, little buddy. Mm, respect, Noogie. Ah. I love you, and you're also a very smart person. This is the greatest gift I've ever received, Leslie. If I'm going to leave Pawnee, I need to know it's gonna be okay without me. I know we should figure out how to fix this, but I'm starting to get kind of turned on imagining you as a dictator, is that bad? No, it's okay. Plus, every time I start talking to you five seconds later, I wanna jump your bones. Oh, let's do that instead. See, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah, okay, let's yeah, do yeah, yeah. Okay, the point is, will you go to the prom with me? Well, I thought you'd never ask, because we're nearing 40. <laughs> of course I will. I mean, I know things are crazy, but th there's no good time, and I want to do it now. Well, buddy, I got some good news for you. This Benjamin nice Wyatt, I don't even know the man what... of my dreams, the one that I love. Shh. But this is your chance, honey. You ready? Not at all. But that's never stopped us before. That is a very smart idea. And that tuxedo makes you look like a sexy orchestra conductor. Here, wave this pen around. Focus. Okay. No, you guys are being ridiculous. This has gone too far, and you are not leaving this office until you've made peace. You missed your friends. And you wanted to come up to the third floor and work with us again. Hey, I've seen you beat tougher odds than this. I do not approve of this. Don't care. My name is Ben Wyatt. And I'm running for Congress. Oh my god, babe, that was so hot. I just want to say thank you. And I love you very much. Is Leslie is a great mother, public servant, all-around person. The Johnny Karate way. Karate out! Hey Goodbye, Pawnee! I will miss you! Hey guys, listen, uh, Leslie's gonna walk in and say something that sounds very boring, but is actually a really big deal. So when I give the signal, just everybody cheer like crazy. Here we go. Mm. It's time to go. Leslie's running for governor of Indiana. What? 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 Oh, 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 Holy for you, nope. That's amazing.